वेलकम एवरी वन इन दिस इंटरेस्टिंग क्वेश्चन वी हैव अ ग्रीन ट्राइंगल विद अ सर्कम सर्कल विद रेडियस फाइव सेंटीमीटर एंड अ इन सर्कल विद रेडियस टू सेंटीमीटर विद दिस लिमिटेड डाटा वी हैव टू फाइंड द डिस्टेंस बिटवीन द सेंटर्स ऑफ दीज टू सर्कल्स और वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स लेट चेक द सोल्यूशन फ्रॉम वट एक्स सी वी आर ज्वाइनिंग द सेंटर पी एंड एक्सटेंडिंग इट टू मीट द सर्कल एट पॉइंट डी Let's join D and B. Now, if you look at the chord BC, this chord BC is subtending an angle of a degree on the circumference, and thus this chord will subtend on the other part of the circle also angle of a degrees. So this angle D is equals to a. Also, we know that from a point, if we are drawing two tangents, then the line joining that external point and the center, that is this line CP. it will bisect the angle contained between these tangents and thus if this full angle is c then this part of angle will be c by 2 now if we look at the chord ad ad is subtending an angle of c by 2 on the circumference and thus it will subtend angle c by 2 on the remaining part of the circle also so this angle here is c by 2 now if we'll join b point b to p now this BP is a line segment from external point to the center of circle so it will divide the angle formed by this tangents so if this full angle is angle B <clears throat> then half of it this will be half of it or B by 2 now if you look at the triangle DPB now in this triangle the sum of angles that is angle D plus B plus P this is 180 degrees but angle D angle D is equal to A so let's replace this d with a angle b angle b is nothing but angle c by 2 plus angle b by 2 so let's replace this angle b with angle b plus c by 2 and 180 degrees let's replace it with a plus b plus c simplifying it a will get cancel on both the sides and we'll get <coughs> angle p is angle b plus c by 2 as this angle is b plus c by 2 and this angle also is b plus c by 2 thus it's an isosceles triangle is there or we can say that the length of dp and db is equal from point b let's draw the diameter of bigger circle and let's join d and e from point p let's join this point of intersection here now if you look at the triangle deb and triangle pfc now in these two triangle as be is diameter so this angle d is 90 degrees and we know that the radius and tangent they are perpendicular so angle f is 90 degrees if you look at the chord db now a chord subtends equal angle on the same side of segment and thus this angle here that is this angle c so this blue angle will be equals to this angle here that angle e now by angle angle similarity we can say that these two triangles are similar to each other as the triangles are similar thus the ratio of side will be equal or we can say that bd upon be will be equal to pf upon pc now putting the values here bd that's equals to dp that we have proved earlier and be length be length is what is the diameter or two times of radius or 10 cm and pf pf here is the radius of inner circle that's 2 cm and pc pc we are not aware of now cross multiplying it we'll get here dp times pc is 2 times 10 or 20 now let's extend this op on both the side now as it's passing through the center of bigger circle thus we can say that mn is the diameter of bigger circle now these two chords that's the blue one the red one and the blue one they are intersecting at point p so by power of point or intersecting chord theorem we can say that mp times pn is equals to dp times pc now here mp is nothing but mo plus x or 5 plus x and same way pn pn will be 5 minus x and dp times pc this we have calculated earlier that's 20 now
Now we open the bracket and solve it to get value of x as root 5 centimeter and that's our answer. I hope you enjoyed the solution. I will see you in next video. Till then, tata, bye bye.